Hello, welcome to the Dana Raider Golf School. My name is Andrew Kiger, and I'm here to teach you guys a little bit about trajectory control today. It's all about how high and how low you can hit the ball around the greens. You want to be able to have multiple shots that you can hit, multiple weapons to use to conquer the game. Okay, so the visualization I'm using today is the visualization of a ladder. Okay, and you want to imagine this ladder is about right here. It's got 10 rungs on it, 10 being the top ladder, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. I'm going to hit it to multiple trajectories using this ball position drill. Okay, you can see I've got 10 balls laid out right here in a row. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Just like I was talking about the different levels of the ladder. Okay, what you want to do when you set up for this ball position drill, okay, you're going to have your feet about hip distance apart. Okay, the fifth ball right here. Right here, the one, two, three, four, five, six ball here, fifth away from the front, that's going to be in the middle of your stance. Okay? You set that up in the middle of your stance, just like so. You have a neutral grip. Okay? That's going to be your neutral ball flight. That's going to hit the, the six ladder rung right in the middle. Okay? This front ball right here, this would be number 10, the highest ball you can hit. That one's going to be the highest ball you're going to hit. Okay, the one in the back here, this one's going to be the lowest. Okay, a couple of things to do while you're doing this. You start off here in the back, you're going to hit this one extremely low. It's going to run a lot and it's going to roll out to the pin. Okay, I've got this ball back in my stance. You notice that ball right there in the middle of my stance. That's that six ball away from the back, right there. And I've got it right here, way back in my stance. One thing you'll notice is this club's a little open. Okay, when you put the ball that far back in your stance, you're going to have to close the club face a little bit. It's also going to help it roll a little bit more. So I get set up here, one, two. That goes right through the bottom rung on the ladder. I'm going to go through it one at a time here. Here's the next one, a little bit higher. Okay, the next one. You can see I'm going to every single ball. That ball is in the middle of my stance. Okay. Getting closer and closer to the middle. You can see this ball is getting higher and higher as I continue to hit these shots. Okay. Going to the fifth one here. See how high that one was? That would be the neutral shot. From now on, I'm getting higher and higher. These are higher lofted shots. That ball is still in the middle. That fifth ball right there is still in the middle of my stance. You guys can see how high that ball is going. Another thing that I do is I tend to get the ball farther forward in my stance. That club face starts to go around the corner and starts to close. I actually start to weaken my grip. That does two things. It gets the ball going higher and it also allows me to get some more spin because that club is going to have more loft as I open it. Another thing you notice, my hands throughout this whole ball position process stay right in front of my zipper. When I was back here, the shaft was leaning very far forward, creating a descending angle on the ball. As I put that ball farther and farther forward in my stance, there becomes a backward leaning shaft that gets the ball more airborne. So I'm right here, I got three more balls left. A little bit weaker stance, that fifth ball is still in the middle of my stance. You guys can see how high these balls are starting to go. Got two more left. These ones, you would call them a lob shot or a flop shot. That next one that I'm getting ready to hit, that would be a flop shot. So I've got that shaft leaning backwards. This would be the ninth rung of the ladder way up there. You guys can see how high that ball is going. This would be the last one here. This is the very, very high flop shot here. See how far forward I've got it. That fifth ball still in the middle of my stance. Wow. So if you want different trajectories, you want to be able to hit different shots into the green, try the 10 ball drill and make sure you're changing your ball positions with that fifth ball staying right in the middle of your stance. You'll be able to control your trajectory much, much better.